All right, uh, hello all. Uh, this is uh, an update uh, for installing VMware Player in Ubuntu uh, version 14.04, 64-bit version, edition. Uh, so as I mentioned uh, in the last video, if you're not sure, uh, you can download actually uh, the one that's both. And it's not that big, but if you know you're using 32-bit, you get this one, and 64-bit is this one, okay? So I've already downloaded it. It's uh, 191 megabytes. So it's just simply a matter of uh, opening wherever you downloaded it to. In my case, it's in the downloads folder. So we'll just uh, control alt T, open a terminal. And we can take the, where it says downloads here, just drag it into the terminal. And press, oops, sorry. And press home and then space and then back, uh, one space back arrow key, change directory, and press enter. Now we should be in this directory here. So I can do, just do a list, ls. And you can see that uh, it's here. So let's uh, double click, and we'll copy, and we'll paste that in. We have to make it executable. So I'll close this window. So press the home key again on your keyboard. And chmod space plus x, another space after that, and press enter. And let's do an ls, and it should have changed color. So we went, um, to signify that it's now executable. It should be just a matter of just uh, double clicking, and we'll copy, and then paste that in. Okay. Uh, press the home on your keyboard again, and put a dot and a slash. Press home again. And it's sudo space sh, another space, and press enter. Type in your password, and we should get uh, VMware Player installer. This will be the uh, GUI installer, of course. So accept uh, license agreement terms. Um, another agreement. Uh, choose what you wish to do, what you want it to do on startup. Um, and then finally next and we obviously this is a the free version or whatever so if we don't there's no um, license key so you hit next and then finally install and with any luck uh, we'll have a VMware player installed and ready to go in Ubuntu 14.04 finally at the end of the installation it says installation successful so we just uh, hit close and you can close out your terminal now. And you go to your dash and you search for VM. And here it is here. And as before, it uh, takes a bit of time to load. But it's a little quicker this time. So if you want to create a new virtual machine, you can do something like install the operating system later and choose like Windows 7, 64-bit, next. And where you want it to, you can browse another partition, another uh, hard drive, or another folder. Hit next, and choose what you want for the size. Hit next, and finish. And close this little uh, wizard dialog. And then you go to, uh, you can edit the virtual machine, change the size of the memory, how many processors you might want to use, and finally where an ISO image would be which I don't have anything uh, set for, but uh, I think if you've used uh, VMware Player before, you know all this uh, stuff. Anyway, so that's uh, that's it. Uh, very simple to install VMware Player in uh, Ubuntu 14.04, either 32-bit or 64-bit. All right? So thanks so much for watching. We'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.